going on? How's everyone doing? Shout out to you. Everybody else who's cool. Shepke! I didn't say. Eat your popcorn. And your Coca Cola and relax. <laughs> anyway, tell Colin I'm rich. Well, what's going on? This is Colin. How's everybody doing? I hope you guys are having a great day so far. All right. This is a quick follow up, not a long one. This is the attorney who got in trouble in front of Judge Simpson about two weeks ago during a prelim. He was threatening the prosecutor. The prosecutor wasn't happy about it. Judge Simpson wasn't happy about it. At the end of the day, the defense attorney said he would file a grievance on himself so the court wouldn't have to do it. Did he do it? We'll see. This is the follow-up. Let's go. People of the state of Michigan versus James Whaley. Good morning. I'm news. David I. Goldstein appearing in place of Jeffrey Bennett, counsel of record. Mr. Bennett is tied up in the court this morning, Your Honor. Mr. Whitley, you have no objection to that? No, Your Honor. All right. Okay, Your Honor. All right, right off the bat, the attorney didn't even show up. Now, I'm not saying that he's not tied up in another court, but this was supposed to be a prelim. I'm going to assume that Goldstein, who we see all the time, he probably told Mr. Bennett, you you go do your other case. Go do it. I'm going to take care of this. You do not want to step in front of Judge Simpson. That's what I'm going to assume happened. Or he's just being a chicken. One of the two. All right, let's go. Your Honor, my understanding is that a preliminary examination had been started in this matter. However, uh, after consultation with Mr. Shipley, Mr. Bennett and Ms. Hughes have agreed to waive the balance of the exam. Uh, yes. And I don't have a problem doing that. However, and I don't know if you're aware of this, Mr. Goldstein, we ran into a problem. I understand that, Your Honor. And I am, I was sort of briefed. I wouldn't say I know all the details. And oh. I'm a little bit, while everybody's here, I'm, I'm a touch bit reluctant to waive, knowing that that issue still exists with well, you read that. Your Honor, my understanding is that Mr. Bennett has hired counsel and that they're in the process of filing a grievance with the attorney with the AGC uh, regarding Mr. Bennett's behavior if that's what the court's referring to that is what I'm referring to um Ms. Hughes did you have a position on that thank you uh, Mr. Bennett's staff member is here she indicated that he has retained Guy Conti and that they will be filing on Friday that's the update that I have on Friday, right. this Friday, because and the reason um, Mr. Goldstein is because that was to be supplied to the prosecutor's office as well as to this court so that I didn't have to do it. My, that's my understanding, Your Honor. Ms. Hughes and I did discuss it briefly before you came out this morning. And that's she understands the same thing I do, which is that it's being taken care of. I mean, I, I understand that's what I told. Yeah, right. Well, that's, that's what I right. That's what I meant. Yeah. All right. Well, knowing Mr. Conti, Your Honor, I think it'll be done. I think it will. Um, Mr. Whitley. Yes, Your Honor. You're waiving your right to a preliminary examination. Your Honor, I'm sorry. I, oh, if you top of the page, you, I, I've got his name wrong. I put Shipley. I'm sorry. You did. <laughs> I was trying to talk. I was trying to listen to you and it was my eyes. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I will that. correct that. So really, you're waiving your right to preliminary examination. Yes, Your Honor. You understand that a preliminary examination is a proceeding where the people would have to show by probable cause that the offense is alleged, the offense alleged was committed and that you committed. Yes, Your Honor. And you understand that you will not have that hearing and that you'll proceed to circuit court for further resolution. Yes, Your Honor. People also waive the rent. Yes, Your Honor. Thank you. Your Honor, for purposes of the arraignment, my client waives reading of the information, stands mute, asks that a not guilty plea be entered. Defendant never waived former reading, standing mute. After being bound over on count one with two following, court will enter a not guilty plea as to both counts. Okay. 
Pre-trial will be set for August 20th at 1.30 p.m. with Judge Comte. August 20th, 2024, 1.30. And we'll continue. Thank you, Your Honor. Thank you. Thank you, Your Honor. For the record, um, the people who were demanding a copy of the preliminary exam transcript from last date, since we did technically start it. Yes. Um, and I'm requesting that that be filed with the circuit court, the transcript of last hearing. Yes. Um, right. And I do believe, based on Mr. Bennett's staff, that that transcript was already prepared as he requested it as part of his grievance. Yes. Thank you, All right. Thank you. All right, that's about it. Not too exciting. I just wanted to do the quick follow up. We were all interested in the first one. So, God know how the case is going. But it looks like it's not going to be in front of Judge Simpson anymore. We'll see if the grievance comes up. I don't think we'll hear about it, though, not unless we do our own research, which I might. All right, until next time. Bye. And I forgot to bring a pen, so I'll just sign electronically and file it with the. Oh, okay. Letter. All right. Very good. Oh, oh, thank you. Thank you so much. I forgot a pen. I know. I, I knew it was a paper and I didn't bring it. Really? Really? Thank you, David. No, I'm going to sit. <laughs> you just 14 stands adjourned or reset. <laughs>